Hey friends, sorry, <laughs> sorry about that. I was uh, getting used to OBS. Hey, how's it going? Um, this is scary. How is everyone doing? Thanks for joining. I can't believe people are actually here. This is wild. You got me now? Okay, cool. Sorry about that. Uh, getting used to OBS is a lot. <laughs> I've got like about 8 billion windows open right now. Um, and I feel like I'm trying to juggle. How you guys doing? Thanks for, yeah, I say, thanks for joining. This is absolutely wild. How many, 16 of you? What the hell? <laughs> That's wild. 19 of you? What the hell is going on? Thanks so much. I appreciate it. Um, yeah, I hope you're having a great day. Do we start the game now? Do I wait until, until more people are in? How does this work? Um, yeah, I don't know if you guys voted on the little poll thing I did, but thanks for voting for Cult of the Lamb. It's something I wanted to play for a while. Um, I've only watched like little bits of people playing it, um, so I've got a, like a very vague idea on what it's like. My understanding is it's like somewhere between uh, Binding of Isaac and uh, like Animal Crossing. Is that about right? Yeah, that's it. Um, yeah, a lot of people said a lot of good things about it. Um, some, I don't know if it's necessarily considered like a cozy game, um, but it seems pretty chill. I'm into, I'm into chill, vibey games. Oh, cool, you guys have played it too. Awesome. Thanks, Gaze Beam, dude. That's a, I appreciate that. Um, to be honest, it like having that video um, sort of go the way it did was uh, like o overwhelming in a very like positive way. Obviously, um, I just wasn't ready for it at all. Um, but I sort of take away that it, I d yeah, it was just like a super positive thing, really, man. Like it, everyone was so kind about it, and. Um, uh, yeah, it was just super overwhelming for people being that nice. Um, and, and yeah, it was just really cool. Like, I really enjoy making videos and like talking about like tech and games and stuff. And it was like, oh, cool. Like maybe, maybe like I could give this a little go. Um, so yeah, it's, it's cool, man. I'm very, very overwhelming. Um, and even the fact that I'm sitting here talking to a camera, talking to you all now uh, is also very overwhelming. <laughs> this feels like it's all happening very quick. Um, I know, everyone Everyone got so angry at me for calling it a console, but like, I don't, what, what is the difference really? Like, is, I, 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 I don't know, like there's, I think um, uh, I follow this guy, um, I forgot his name, Denki, and he made a post about this, he also made a video about the Steam Deck, and um, he called it a console too, and it's interesting, he uh, put together a load of comments about like, arguments for and against it being a console and it was kind of funny um but yeah sorry about that everyone how is the stream quality can you hear everything okay is things are things streaming all right um again i'm very new to this i hopefully set it up okay it's just frozen on my obs am i still here yeah thanks for so much for joining live man oh my god like so many people talking what the hell Thanks, uh, everyone. <laughs> yeah, it's really good to catch you guys as well. Thanks so much for joining. No worries about going, man. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Uh, I'll hopefully catch you really soon, yeah? Perfect quality, cool, okay, thank you. Quality is looking good, thank you. The audio is a little out of sync, okay. Um, I'll be honest, I have no idea how to sort that. Um, if, okay. 
If anyone has any idea why that may be lagging, let me know. Maybe use your console to fix it. <laughs> okay, so the audio syncs alright for other people. Oh man, I'm sorry about that. I will try and figure that out um, uh, a little bit later. I don't want to interrupt too now, and it might be a bit make this a bit of a mess. But thank you. I'm glad everything else is coming across okay. At least you can hear me. <laughs> Yeah, thanks guys. And yeah, I feel like I just keep saying thank you, but uh, yeah, thanks so much for joining. Um, there's 23 of you, what the hell? What is going on? <laughs> um, yeah, let me know how your day is going. Should we start the game now? I think we should start the game now. Um, where's the button for that? <laughs> okay, there we go. Can you see that? Let me know if that's all coming across okay. And can you hear the audio? Awesome, okay. Man, this is so scary! Not the game, but just just streaming in general. This is crazy. <laughs> all good? All good? Nice one, okay. Uh, let me know if you've played this game too. Uh, I had a load of people recommend it. A lot of people have been talking about it. Uh, yeah, let me know where you're up to, how you're finding it, all that jazz. Um, okay, let's let's go straight into it, shall we? I say that like I haven't been wasting the last seven minutes of your time. <laughs> Praise the light of... Oh, I didn't get a chance to read it. <laughs> Yet sacrificial beast. Take heed, for a crown cannot sit upon two brows. Okay. Hey man, how's it going? Enzival, how you doing man? Okay, uh, wait, let me move my thing around. So we're starting tied up. Kinky. I like it. Oh, okay. Are they following me? I'm doing good, man. Thanks so much for joining. How's your day going? All right. Let's get sacrificed by the looks of it. Hey, boys. Oh, I just wanted a little kiss. Mwah. Mwah, give me a little kiss. This guy give me a little kiss? Mwah, yes, thank you. Mwah. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. My voice is coming in a bit too loud compared to the game sound. Thank you, dude. Thank you. I'll up the PC sound a little bit. And down my voice a little bit. Let me know if that's a little bit better. Totally, yeah, the art style is proper cool already. The um, the colours are absolutely wicked in this game already. Before us stands the last of its kind. All others we have hunted down and put to the blade. Is he talking about lambs? With this final sacrifice, the prophecy will be impossible to fulfil. The heretic who lies upon is bound, lies bound below will condemn to eternal captivity, and the old faith should be preserved. Okay. How could you sacrifice a little lamb? No, oh, he did it. He did it. Uh, is that is the audio better now? Okay. This is like um, that bit in Kingdom Hearts, you know, where you uh, go into the the other little world after you drop down from the sky, and there's that opera music playing. You've been editing today? What? What do you edit? Are you, do you, are you YouTube guy too? Come closer, fear not, for thou art already dead. I still have need for you. Okay, so being saved. Those foolish bishops thought they could keep you from me in death, but instead they send you straight to me. I will give you life again, but at a price. 
All I ask is to, you to start a cult in my name. Do we have a deal? Absolutely. Why else would we be here? So it's in his name, not ours? Yes! <laughs> oh yeah! Oh, we get a sword now too? Okay, what? Dodging, nice. Woo! Oh! Just like the world that never was, exactly. <laughs> okay. Oh Jesus. Easy. Easy game. Oh, ooh. Oh hey. Ratua, fear not, I am Ratua. I was a once chosen vessel like you, but those days are lost to the winds. I was sent to guide you. We are deep in the lands of the old faith and in grave danger. My instructions are to lead you safely, continue through the woods, escape lies ahead, and I will be close by. So wait, is he, was he a cult leader and he also escaped? Hacha! Oh man, I love the noise they make when he rolls. You can't really hear it now, but... Easy. Easy. Oh, okay. A coin. Cool. Cool story, bro. Cool. Oh, okay. Where's my life bar? Do I have one? Another coin, thank you very much, sir. Whoop. These freaking batch. Three coins, is that all we get? I want a bigger sword. Okay. Eee. I'll make coins for days and a little pool. I'm confused. Where's my health? Oh, sorry. Um, have I used Emu Deck? I I was thinking of making a video about it. I'm not gonna lie. Um, uh, yeah, like, um, emulation is like a massive thing on Steam Deck, a lot of people love that stuff. Uh, I really wanted to give, I really wanted to give Rogue Galaxy a go. Has anyone ever played that on PS2? I really wanted to emulate that, so I was looking into emu deck for that. Um, I just haven't really got around to it, but I might make a video about it. Let me know if you want me to make a video about that. We have nearly reached safety, but look ahead. Another poor soul is about to be sacrificed. Rescue them and they would have no choice but to join your new cult. Oh no, a little bunny. What are they, what is it with killing poor innocent little creatures? Almighty oh, bishops of the old faith, we ask you to accept the sacrifice of this wretched soul. Hey, who interrupts the ritual of our and trespasses on our sacred, sacred ground? Okay. Oh shit, I keep pressing um, A to roll. Nope. 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 Ha! Yeah! Easy. Don't worry, little bunny. I've got ya. I've got it. I'll save ya. I'll save ya. What the hell just happened there? <laughs> I just eat him? <laughs> I just like sucked him in. Jesus. <laughs> okay. Sure. Um. 
Cool. Okay, I, I'll think about I'll think about that emu deck video then. It seems a little bit complicated to set up, hence why I've been apprehensive. But I'll give it a go. If you if if it'll be helpful for you, I'll give it a go. Uh, thanks so much, Kevin man. Um, thank you. Really appreciate it. Hope you have a good rest of your day, Kevin boy. Thank you. Um, time for games. How's it going, man? Uh, yeah, I'm using a little Sony camera and. Uh, I've got this this chunky light here, which actually went wrong uh, just before the stream, and it really stressed me out. But it's working reasonably well now, so um, hopefully it's coming across reasonably well. Oh, okay. So it is it is easy to use once you we have reached safety. You have done well. The red crown will allow you to use markings on the ground to transport yourself to great distances. It will take you to a temple that has fallen ruin. There you will be able to begin your new cult. I will meet you. Oh, sorry, I've been doing this like almost like American voice. I will meet you there. It's more what it sounds like. Um. Thank you, man. Yeah. What? How did you um download a music on your? on your Steam Deck? Was it through a YouTube video? Um, I've seen some that are pretty good. Um, I just get a little bit confused with like super technically used stuff, but yeah, if you've got a good guide or something, let me know, man. Hey, Perry, how's it going, man? Thanks for joining. Hope you're doing well, man. Heretics defeated. Oh, are these little like achievements? Oh, I can't take it on. Okay. Yeah, I can't. Sorry, I think I feel like I'm messaging. Uh, I'm missing messages. Uh, yeah, Lynn. Yeah, what uh, what kind of YouTube videos do you make, man? That's that's really cool. Um, yeah, I'll I'll send me over your uh, profile, man. I'll give you a little subscribe. Ends evil, that is. <laughs> I'm just reading your thing about editing. Um, hey Ryan, how's it going, man? Thank you so much for joining the stream. How are you doing? Uh, finally got your Steam Deck. Yes, dude. H how are you finding it? I know loads of people getting theirs like this this week because, um, like, uh, Valve essentially like lets you like buy them now, or they're like catching up to the supply and stuff. So. It seems like um, tons of people are getting them now, which is super cool. Yeah, let me know how you're finding it, dude. I literally, uh, to be honest, this is the first game I've played not on my Steam Deck since Elden Ring in February. So I have been uh, seriously loving mine, if you couldn't tell from all the videos. Uh, what difficulty should we go for? Um, I'm going to go for medium because I'm a, I'm a little bitch. And... Uh, uh, it's hard to play games and talk and stream at the same time. Oh, this is nice. This hallowed ground, which oh, sorry, this hallowed ground, which once was mine, is now yours. This crumbling ruin in the sight of your new cult. We have much to do. We begin by indoctrinating this poor soul into the warm embrace of your cult. Followers can gather resources for you. Order, order this one to collect that lumber or stone. Oh, it's our boy. It's our bunny boy. Hey. <gasps> Please spare me. I'll spare you, boy. Ah. Wait. <gasps> we can give him a name? <laughs> yes. Um, what's a good name for bunny boy? Let me know. Let me know a good name for bunny boy. I'm leaning towards Keith. <laughs> A university professor. Wow, dude. What do you teach? That's crazy. Oh, no way. Oh, thanks so much for tuning in between your lessons, man. That is, that's crazy. What do you, yeah, let me know what you teach, dude. That's insane. Um, you teach music. Yes, dude. 
Where, what uh, university do you teach at? Um, I'm also a music teacher. I'm not, I'm not as nearly as qualified as you are, um, but I run, like, I run a charity uh, and we work with, like, um, work with lots of people with like, special needs and like, dementia. I work a lot within like, younger people as well. Um, and yeah, we sort of like, gather funding and go around to like, schools and care centers and stuff and do music. Um, but yeah, you probably know way more about music than I do. So that's super cool, dude. Um, name them as your viewers. Well, I should call him the viewers, or I should name them after one of you. <laughs> oh, yes. Um, Ryan, Fable Anniversary is such a good game. That, is, that holds up so well. The dialogue and like, all the, the NPC chat in that game is so unbelievably funny. I absolutely love it. Like, um, so British as well. Like, the, the sarcasm and the dryness in some of the dialogue is just so funny. And yeah, the Metal Gear Solid games, man. I I loved uh, 4 and 5. To be honest, I haven't played the older ones, which I feel really bad about. I'm sort of half waiting for them to make like a, a remaster or something to play. But that is another series that would be sick on Steam Deck. Um, Gerald. Gerald's a good one. Um... Zach, how you doing, man? Thanks for joining the stream. Um, yeah, Outer Wilds is sick, isn't it? It's such a good game. Really, really lovely. Um, proper chill, uh, but yeah, really like, um, really clever with how they did that. Like, there's so much in that game that makes it so special. Um, I really love the music in particular. That's just super beautiful. Um, James, how you doing, man? Thanks so much for joining. Um, oh, thanks, man. That. Everyone's so, like, bloody nice, like, I've only done, like, four videos, and you're too nice, I don't know what to say, <laughs> I have to get overwhelmed, um, but yeah, thank you, man, I I'm releasing a new video, hopefully this weekend, um, I feel a bit nervous about uploading this one, um, but yeah, hopefully, hopefully it's enjoyable, <laughs> um, called him Funny, Funny the Bunny, that's a good one, Keith the Bunny, Funny the Bunny, um, how you doing, ne uh, how can I say your name, Neck Necrosphere, how you doing man, how you doing? Working from home, cool man, what do you, what do you do? Um, I'm so sorry, I feel like I'm half not playing the game, I just, um, uh, I'm just enjoying the chat, you know? Keith? You like the word Keith? <laughs> Is that Amy? Is that Amy? Are you watching? <laughs> okay, we got, I think we're gonna go with Keith. Thank you, Marg Roll. I appreciate that. Thank you, Keith. <laughs> okay, uh, let's go with Keith. And let's give him a face. Oh, I feel bad about changing him. Or should we change him? I think Keith suits... I think Keith suits this this pig a little bit better. Maybe let's go with... Let's go with that. Choose... Oops. Okay. Little piggy. And we can change the colour. I think... I think a little blue piggy suits Keith. Variant. <gasps> we can give him a cool hairstyle. I think this one. Uh, traits. On recruiting followers, immediately lose 10 faith. What does that mean? Gain 10 faith when falling ill. What does this mean? Oh, we'll figure it out. <laughs> Hit that beach, skate, uh, Keith. Oh, okay, so we can make him do stuff. Let's get him to chop some trees. Some yes, Keith. By your hand, our cult will grow powerful. 
But your followers cannot live on prayer alone. They must eat. Of course, Keith, Keith's a hungry boy. He's working up an appetite, can't that tree down? Um, gather the necessary resources and build a cooking fire. It will allow you to prepare meals for your followers. Okay, first mission, feed Keith. Um, how, wait, how do we do that? I wasn't really listening. Build a fire. Uh, okay, can I not feed him with the berries? Apparently not. Oh, okay, so I can chop down stuff too. Hey, uh, I'm, I feel like I'm gonna say all your names wrong. Uh, Brigham? Is that how you say it? Brigham? Got me running on a second monitor. Yes, dude. I need to get one of those. I'm juggling like about 20 tabs on one monitor. But thanks for tuning in, dude. I appreciate that uh, you tuning in while working. It does feel nice to join a cult, Connor. It does feel good. I'm feeling good about it. I'm feeling wholesome. I'm looking forward to feeding Keith. I'm looking forward to building him a little fire. Uh, I'm looking forward to sacrificing some followers. Um, I'm looking forward to collecting stone, apparently. Just get some extra wood, you know. Grab some extra rock. Okay. Operation Feed Keith is a go. Oh, mate, I've got wood for days. Yes. Oh, this is cool. Um, yeah, this is like Stardew Valley-esque. Is Keith going to come build it? No yes! <laughs> Go, Keith, go. Oh, can I help? Yeah. <laughs> he was so happy doing that. Look at his little face. Uh, your followers need to eat, uh, provide meals for them. Oh, Jesus. Keith, you're so needy. Hunger reveal cult can be seen on the top left of the screen. When this gets too low, followers will begin to starve. Find more food while crusading. Pick routes that pass through foraging locations. Okay. Plant farms to grow your own food. Seeds can be purchased or found while crusading. Okay. Um, no worries if you've got to get back to work, man. I really appreciate you coming on board for a bit. Thanks so much, man. Have a good rest of your day. You just got someone Keith in a meeting. <laughs> Damn it, Keith. I oh, know he's actually doing a good job. Thank you, Keith. Thank you. Um... Okay, so we're making a meal for Keith now. Uh, do I do it here? Okay. Oh boy, Keith. You're getting a big old basic berry bowl. I hope you like berries. Oh, okay. Now we must build a shran. First we will need more followers and more gold. Okay. Both of which can be found when crusading through the lands of the old faith. Our mutual benefactor, the one who waits, has been trapped by the four bishops of the old faith. Each of them guards a chain that binds him to the realm beyond. We have conjured openings to the rare realms. It is your task to track them down and slay them so that he may be freed. Now go! There you shall find gold and willing recruits. And, though, uh, and for those who are not willing, convert them by force. Okay. Okay, little rat boy. I'll do as you say. It's not being played on the Steam Deck. No, I did. I thought people would, would maybe think that. Um, I'm, I reckon you probably can stream um, from the Steam Deck, uh, but it's a little bit too complicated for me. I thought it'd just be easier to jump on PC, but I'm almost certain you can do it. Um, uh, yeah, Catherine, how's it going, man? Thanks so much for joining. Um, yeah, it's cool, isn't it? It's like... Um, 
it's almost like Paper Mario esque, uh, sort of Paper Mario crossed with like Animal Crossing. Um, and yes, it is just the game music. I wasn't, I wasn't sure whether to make it more complicated by trying to set up music, but I might, if I keep streaming, I might set up some music if that's what streaming people do. Okay, do I go this way? I hope so. Oh. Uh, what was that? <laughs> Do I go in here, I'm guessing? Darkwood. Are these just different, like, stages? Yeah, okay. So I need nine followers for that one. Uh, seven for that one. And twelve for that one. Okay. Alright. Be right back, Keith. Um, TTYD, what's that? TTYD, am I being an idiot? TTYD. The... <laughs> thousand year... Thousand year door. What's that? I don't think I've ever heard of that. Oh man, I've, n I've never heard of it. I bloody loved the GameCube though. I, was, I watched a video about that today. Um, I, it was honestly, I mean, I don't know whether my favourite's that or the PS2 um, for that sort of generation, but my goodness, I loved the GameCube. That was such an absolute banger of a console. Uh, entering the lands of the Bishop Leash Leshy. Those who do not follow the words of the elf ape will be destroyed. Okay. Oh, it's Paper Mario. Oh, okay. I'm being an idiot. Thank you. Okay. Time to concentrate. We got we got Keith to think of. Oh Jesus. PSC seems to hit around would never be the same. <laughs> I. I, I, maybe this is a controversial opinion, but I absolutely loved um, Star Fox Adventure. That was like one of my first like adventure games, and I played that game so many times. Um, yeah, it's not exactly like a traditional Star Fox kind of game, but oh man, I loved it. That like Wind Waker, possibly like my favorite game of all time. Um, Smash Bros, obviously, absolute banger. I also, I never had a Nintendo 64, so I played like all of the original Zelda games on the GameCube as well, like um, Majora's Mask and Ocarina of Time. Yeah, it was good, and I'm glad you liked it too, because everyone hates on it so, so much, like it was this sort of like abomination, but I absolutely loved it. I felt like for the time, I like, I, I think I had a Dreamcast before um, the GameCube, but I was so young I didn't really understand about computers and stuff. And I remember playing through Sonic Adventure 2, just the intro, probably about like a hundred times because uh, I didn't know how to use a memory card. <laughs> An archway of woven blooms, blooms and vans. Oh, that's cute. I'll buy it. Uh, I am a bit of a 90s kid, yeah. I am a bit of a 90s kid. I'm 20, 27, so 90s boy, for sure. Um, yeah, I I love RPGs, man. They're, I, I think, yeah, they're some of my favourite games. Like, Persona 5, uh, Final Fantasy X, Kingdom Hearts are like some of my favourite games of all time. I know a bit, well, some of them are a bit dated, but... Yeah, no worries, Connor man. Thank you so much for joining. I really appreciate it, dude. Um, enjoy the rest of your your teaching. Um, I'll catch you soon, man. Thanks again. Um, 
Yeah, Sonic Adventure 2 absolutely slaps. Oh wait, no, where's, where's it? So no, it was the original Sonic Adventure I played on Dreamcast, sorry. And also Sonic Adventure 2 uh, I played on GameCube. Absolute banger of a game. Running around at the speed of sound. Whoa! Oh, I'm an idiot, okay. Um, was I meant to be harvesting wood in those other places? Uh, who's my Smash Bros main? Obviously Link. Who else? <laughs> uh, now I go between Link, Captain Falcon a little bit. Um, who else do I go between? Uh... What's I go between in Smash Bros? I I don't I haven't actually got a Switch and uh, but I played my sister's uh, Smash Bros for a while and I mainly just stuck with Link like 90% of the time. He's my boy. Can I can I kill them? No. <laughs> uh. Yeah, man, there's some great suggestions. Yeah, I've heard so much about uh, Divinity. I've never given it a try, but everyone raves about that game, man. Um, love Elder Scrolls, which is great. I haven't tried Cyberpunk, I'll have to admit. Um, I know it's like got this really bad rap at the beginning of its release, but I feel like they've sorted most of the issues out, if I'm right. Ooh. Jesus. <gasps> Do I get a new sword? Yes! That's what I wanted. Recycle? Oh, I could turn my old... My old sword into coins. Who knew? Uh, ooh, okay. Oh yeah, I totally should have been smashing those things, shouldn't I? Oh no, they haven't got anything in there. Give me those coins, boy. Yes, dude. Um, oh, hang on a sec, sorry. I've, I essentially have got a switch now. <laughs> yeah, I, I need to I need to properly go into emulation. Um, I, 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 was, I don't know if you were here earlier, but um, I was saying that I am contemplating making like an emulation Steam Deck uh, video um, because I really want to get yeah, some Nintendo games on my Steam Deck, but... Uh, yeah, I, it's just it just looks a little bit complicated, but someone was saying earlier that it's actually not too bad, so I might give it a go. Um, yeah, man, definitely play the Zelda games, dude. I know, I know, like everyone says about it, but Breath of the Wild honestly is just like one of the best games ever made. Praise the Lamb, conduit to great power, promised liberator to the ones that wave below. So the card, the card showed me once many lifetimes ago, or has yet that to be. Am I reading this right? <laughs> I don't know if I am. I've always drawn your cards, Lamb, and yet this is the first. Take these cards, and I will draw another time we meet. When the power, when drawn by me, they will grant you power. He's like a little ducky. A praying ducky. Uh, what power? Well, that is both known and unfathomable. The cards, they shall decide. A heart offered, a vow made. One heart or attack rate increased. Um, I'm gonna go for attack because I'm not a little bitch. <laughs> the fates have spoken. Who will listen? Huh. Oh man, I've got... What do I do with these? Can I... Uh... Do I use these? What the... Uh... Okay, so I just collect them, I can't like use them. Okay. Um... Hey, uh, I, again, I'm very sorry about pronouncing everyone's names wrong, but Shubayeb, <laughs> Shubayeb, um, I haven't played Disco Elysium, but it looks super good. Um, 
Hi, good question. Yeah, I really want to play Disco Elysium. I might play. I don't know. I don't know how this whole streaming thing uh, is gonna go. I don't know if people are enjoying it or whatever. But I, I might, maybe I'll stream Disco Elysium one day. That seems like a really fun game. Um, Twenty set. Hey, mayhem, man. How's it going? Thanks for joining. Um, yeah, man. The that's exactly it. The SNES, PlayStation One, the GameCube are the bee's knees. Um, oh shit, sorry, I was reading the chat. Stupid worms. I've got to get back to Keith. Leave me alone. Okay, oh. Um, mummy? Keith? <laughs> no. Leshy? How can this be? You were put on the blade, lamb. All of us your kind were, uh, as all of your kind were, and yet here you stand before me, unrepentant. The, the crown is power, could it be? But I am stronger still. Tail, turn tail and run, little lamb. I will, little bitch. Um, I don't have a Twitter, man. I. I'm really unprepared uh, for like any sort of online interaction stuff. I absolutely suck, uh, but I'll set one up, maybe. You have come far enough, little lamb. My followers are willing to do anything for me. Can you say the same for yourself? Yes, Keith's got my back, man. Of course. I give myself to the cause of my leader. By the blood of the great ones, destroy the red crown. Ugh. You're an ugly little boy. Is he weeing out of his head? Oh, okay. It's one of one of these guys. Poops out little little boys. I will defeat your little poop boys. And you? <laughs> He's just pissing all over me. Stop. Listen, Amadurus, I've got a Keith to get back to. He's cold and alone, and you're getting in my way. I've had enough of you. Oh, God. You and your little poop boys, leave this place. Ah, It's a little poop head boy. <laughs> Uh, convert me to your cult and I'll follow your teeth things faithfully. Thanks, little poop boy. Ooh. Uh, I feel like we've got tons of wood. Flower necklace? Yeah, I'm going to give the flower necklace to Keith. Yes, yes, 100%. Easy choice. Keith's getting a necklace. A pretty little necklace. You should put Steam Deck Verified in the title. <laughs> I should have. I'll do that next time. Return to the... Okay. Oh, so I have to pass through, like... Do I have to pass through four times and I maybe unlock that door? Maybe? I'm coming home, Keith. I'm coming home. You still get your mates around for old school gaming sessions. Yes, dude, that's so cool. I wish I had cool friends that wanted to play Mario Kart with me. <laughs> Kirby's Air Ride. Oh man, I completely forgot about that game. What a banger. I'm relieved to see you made it safely and you have not returned alone. You have convinced more to join your faithful flock. Let's indoctrinate this new convert so that we may continue. Yes, little rat boy. Okay. Convert me to your cult and I'll follow your teachings faithfully. Alright. 
Um, I'm gonna call you. Oh, stinky little poop. I guess stinky little poop. <laughs> I was gonna put him poop head, but I've run out of characters. Stinky little poop. That works. <laughs> Colin? Maybe Colin? What should I go for? You guys need to decide. Colin, Stinky Lil Poo, um, Poop Head. I could go Poop. Poop Head? Mm. Not very inventive. Um. <laughs> stinky, Stinky Lil Poo. <laughs> um. Stinky little poo. Okay. I quite like, I think I need to keep his little poo head, don't I? Yeah, I need to keep that. Um, I feel like it makes sense to go brown. Mm, but. Yeah, let's go brown. He was 15% faster. I stinky little poo. Let's go. Trust your gut. Dingleberry. Yeah. Oh, damn it. <laughs> okay. Uh, so Keith's collecting trees. So let's go for some stone. We stinky little poo. Followers will either work or worship. Worshiping generates. Followers generate devotion. What is that symbol next to devotion? That looks a bit suspect to me. <laughs> um, but to collect devotion, you require a shran. All right, let's build one of them, boy. Okay, cost, some, cost me some coin. All right, come on, Keith. Nah, thank you for looking after the place for me. Look at this. Keith and little poo, stinky little poo, Working together. Have you seen anything? Seen anything this beautiful? Praise be, your followers can now worship you. Here is a new follower. Sign them to your worship at the shrine. And collect devotion, your followers generate the shrine to unlock divine inspiration. Oh, okay. It's a little piggy. Okay. Who else do you say? Colin. Let's go for Colin on this one. Oop. Colin. Join the club. I quite like him as a little piggy. Um. Mm, maybe a horse. And let's make him. Let's go for, let's go for that. Okay. Come on in, Colin. Join the club. Join the party. That just looks gross. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> that is some devotion, all right. Collect devotion from your shrine. Once you collect enough, you will unlock divine inspiration. The more followers, wor the more followers worshiping at your shrine, the faster they will fill up. Fill up. Uh, if the shrine is full, they will stop worshiping until it's emptied. Uh, once you've collected divine inspiration, unlock new buildings from your cult. The shrine. Wait, let me read that again. I'm an idiot. Uh, collect, collect devotion. Once you have enough, you'll get divine inspiration. The more followers worshipping the shrine, the faster they'll fill up. The shrine is full, they'll stop worshipping until it's emptied. Once you've collected divine inspiration, unlock. Okay. So they have to worship until I unlock some more stuff. Thank you, Colin. I can speak to you too. Ah. Pet dog? Find a meal. Oh yeah, we've got to give Keith his his necklace. Pet dog. <laughs> oh Colin. I get I That was nice. 
That was a nice little intimate moment with Colin. Join the club, Colin. Join the club. Right. Let's give Keith his little uh, his little necklace. There you go, Keith. There you go. Ah! You look so pretty. You look so pretty, Keith. I love you. Um. Right. So, collect. Oh, okay. Divine inspiration unlocked. Establish them. Is that what I'm meant to be doing? Oh, we can make little a farm plot. A sleeping bag? Let's make a sleeping bag for Keith. Oh. Build a temple? Okay, I need some more rock. Let's get Keith on that. Keith! No, stop. Stop what you're doing right now. You need to work, boy. Find me some... Find me some rubble. And you too, stinky little poo. Wait, are you already doing that? Yeah, you're already doing that. Carry on. Carry on. Well, do, do, does my rock get s sent straight to me? Or do I have to collect it from the boys? I'm not getting any rock. Okay. We'll have to just do it ourselves. Yeah, look, what happens when... when oh. Oh, does it go into here? Uh, I have no idea. Well, at least we're clearing out some space for our, our new, our new, our new home. Wow, look at this! Oh, mate, that's gonna take forever. Screw that. Okay, how are we doing now? We're ready. Wait, a hundred and... A hundred and eight stone? No. Wood? Where's... How's that happened? Have they been working while I've been away? What good little... What a good little Keith. <laughs> Alright, let's put our temple... Let's put it there. Oh, come on. Come on, boys. Join, join the temple building crew. Yes. No worries at all, man. Um, thanks so much for joining, dude. Hope you have a good rest of your day, man. Enjoy V Rising. I don't know what that is either, but enjoy enjoy that, man. Um, thanks for joining. I'll catch you soon, yeah? Uh, the temple is the centre of your cult. From there, you'll preach sermons to grow stronger, perform rituals to mould the fragile minds of your followers. You are responsible for maintaining the faith of your cult. If it falls too low, your followers will be dis dissent against you and eventually leave. Wow. The followers are ready to hear your word. Show them that they are show them that you're their great leader. Preach a sermon from within your temple. Wow. This really is a cult, isn't it? Uh, Alright. <laughs> look at look at me. <laughs> who would who would follow that face? I would. I would follow that face. Nothing nothing suspicious about him. Okay, let's bring in the boys. Keith, stinky little poo. Colin, give me that white stuff. <laughs> the faith your followers will grow stronger. Performing sermons will draw power from them and allow you to unlock new abilities, weapons, and curses. Followers with higher loyalty levels will generate more devotion. Therefore, followers will have more, and uh, have and the more loyal they are, the quicker you'll be able to gain new abilities. Okay. Bane weapon. Let me gain half a heart. Okay, so it's just like it's just like a little upgrade tree. So the more everyone loves me, the more I get to upgrade. That's cool. Thank you, boys. I 
Show your love. Yeah, all the pizza. Okay, so you do one a day. Okay. You are amazing to behold. A natural leader. I see why you were chosen. If you got a. Uh, if you are to guide your cult, you will need to declare doctrine so that they might obey you. Return to the lands of the old faith and seek out commandment of stone fragments. The, with these, you will be able to declare new doctrines. Okay, cool. So, while I'm away, I better get the boys, the boys on some jobbies. So, I'm guessing they work while I'm fighting and stuff. They're both on... I've got quite a lot of wood at the minute. I don't know if I should put one of the boys onto... onto wood. What else can we do? Um, I feel like it makes sense for them all to be doing something different. I guess, for now. Oh, are they hungry? Uh, I don't think so. I need to remind myself. So, I cook them food over here. 15% chance of the following pooping instantly. <laughs> I want that to happen. How do we make that happen? Wait, um, can I feed them when they're not hungry? Um, and what is this thing at the top? Is that how much they love me? Um, I just want to make them poop. Let's feed them a little. Let's feed them a little a berry stew. I can't actually remember how. Do I just go over to them and feed them? I don't, do I? How do I feed them again? I'm such an idiot. How do I feed them? I completely forgot. Oh no, I go over here. Uh, wait. Oh, there we go. I'm an idiot. <laughs> what? Why am I such an idiot? Why? Wait, what is? Our stinky little poo's gonna eat it all in bowl by himself. Is he gonna poo? Come on. Come on. No! <laughs> Damn it. Okay. Right, so let's go back out and, and kill some boys. Oops. Uh, thank you, man. Yeah, if I'll, um... I'll note down your YouTube channel right now because I'll go over and give you a little subscribe and I could use some help with the emu deck, I'm not gonna lie. So do you, I'm always confused, do you need um, the actual keys from other games to be able to play on emulators? I always get so confused. Uh, I don't think we can unlock any of these. Yeah, I think the other one needed seven. So I think I'll go back into here. Okay, let's go. <gasps> I get an axe. Yes! Can I switch? Oh, yeah. I can't... Wait, did my little hat come off? It did. <laughs> um. Okay. Oh man, that's a lot slower. Am I? S I think I moved a bit slower as well. Okay. Yep. 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 Easy. Easy. Yep. 
This is um, reminding me of Hades a little bit. I suppose I say that they're all procedurally generated games are all like this really, aren't they? Are we all but players in this game of chance? Uh, Death's Door, good game. Um, when hit down to half heart, let's do two damage or attack rate. I'm just all about that attack rate, you know? I don't think it's hard enough yet to warrant a boost to like health and stuff. Fate to spoken, who will listen? Okay. Let's go. You again? I'm glad I found you. I bring good news. The one who waits is pleased with your progress and wishes to grant you a crown ability. Give me the goods. Ah. Whoa. Oh man, that recoil. Look at me fly back. Whoa. <laughs> okay, cool. Do I have... Just label drop Fervor. Collect this to replenish your curses. Cool, okay. Cool, okay, so it's like ammo for my gun of blood. Skull A follower will live an unnaturally long life, double what would usually be expected. Do they die? Do, do they have a lifespan? Is Keith going to die? Well, I've given Keith a necklace. Am I spoiling him if I give him the skull necklace too? Can he wear two necklaces at the same time? Probably not. Pronounced fur fur. Thank you. Is that how you say it? Fur 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 fur. <laughs> Oh, it's this guy again. Tell me, lamb, do you believe in destiny? Immutable? What does these? What does he mean? Much of the overall weapon damage increased. <coughs> yeah, let's go for that. I'm more of a melee kind of guy than a, a shooty kind of guy. Let's go. Ah, oh. it's a little cow this time. The worm is hungry. It feeds, it partakes of our flesh, but that is a price for safety. For that, we gladly give all we have. Oh, you sound pathetic. It's not that bad. Oh, this... oh shit, missed. Yeet. Where's all the Flervla? Where's all the Flervla? Furfur. Ah, <laughs> oh, poor little cow. It's okay. It's okay. I'll save you. I'll save you. Come with me. We're gonna go. We're gonna go join Keith. Oh. That looks like a little boss room. Okay, I'm starting to understand this now. I'm such an idiot. Steel devotion. <laughs> oh. Okay, here he is. Here's little Leashy. So you foolishly persist, little lamb. I hear your lies and I smell your fear. The red crown rises again. Oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> kill Lishi in the dark wood. I will. I will kill Lishi. Thank you. Where's all the flare of left? The flare of left. Am I get? Oh, there we go. That takes ages to charge up. Okay, so I probably shouldn't be spamming that like I just did. 
which is fine, because I got a big old, big old axe. Woo! Flaming shot two? I barely used flaming shot one. Hold and release. Okay. Nice. We're getting coins. We're getting flaming bolts. We're getting money. We're... What is this? Pick up stone fragment. What do all of these do? Eons ago, these lands were rife with gods and their adherents. What befell this pantheon, alas? Tis the nature of the beasts for to forget and of gods to be forgotten. Mayhem they left, mayhem they s- may, Mayhap they left, mayhap they slept. Mayhap they devoured the devoured in turn. Those who, those who remained spread roots, spun webs, molded this world to meet them and theirs. Twere a land of many gods once, hundreds now. Can I pick up all of them? Oh, I can. Oh, you found enough fragments to form a command commandment stone. Commandment stones are used to declare new doctrines of your cult to follow. Use the altar in your temple to declare a new doctrine whenever you form a new commandment stone. Cool. Okay. You again? How do you get around to all these places? Oh, reveal the map. Yeah. Oh. That's what I needed. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. This is the perfect time to use my little... My little... Oh, no, okay. That. Ooh. Mate, that runs out so quick. I don't know if I even hit him. Ugh. Uh. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I'm killing him very slowly. Whoop, whoop. Ugh. Okay, this one is notably harder than the last. Ugh. Ugh. Yes. Oh, a Twiggy. Wait, are those twigs? Or oh, antenna? See you later. Say hello to Keith for me. And stinky little poo. Um, okay, I don't think we've got any berry bush seeds yet. So let's go for that. Oh boy! Look at all those coins! It is adorably hellish. It really is. Oh, wait, no, we've been here. Whoops. Easy. Easy! I still had two whole hearts left. Oh yeah, I've got to give that necklace to someone. Who should I give the necklace to? I'm leaning towards Stinky Little Poo. Um, very good, my vessel. It seems I chose well when I kept you from death. I'll be watching your every move. Do not disappoint me. Okay, Daddy. Okay. I am guessing that we are gonna kill him at the end, or at least try to. Okay, let's see how the boys are getting on. Your followers are inspired by your successful crusade. So they should be. 
we're gonna collect some divine inspiration. <gasps> we can build a little bed for 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 Keith. A place for your followers to sleep. Very unstable. Will often collapse. <laughs> Whoops. Sorry, Keith. Can I get that as well? No. Uh, okay. How you doing, Colin? Doing good. I like your little your little your little coat. Okay, so let's build a bed. Do I have to sleep outside? <laughs> that seems mean. <laughs> um. Let's build a house, a bed next to, we'll put it next to the, the shrine, I think. Oh, I can't. Uh, mm, you. Let's put it next to the shrine. Wait, what? All right, let's put it under the trees. Wait. Oh, have I just been building several of them? Oh, whoops. I mean, wait, there's three there, isn't there? I, I totally meant to do that. I totally meant to do that. Three for the boys. All my boys are covered. Right. I am an absolute idiot and I can't remember what that praying thing in the top left is. And I don't know how to upkeep it. Is it by doing this? Drawing. Is it a sermon that boosts that? We'll give it a go. Right, listen up, listen up, boys. Oh, okay, it is. Nice. Uh... Oh man, there's so many menus in this game. Use the commandment stone to declare a new doctrine for your cult. Select from the category to make a choice that will unlock either a new ritual trait or follower interaction. Oh, we can we can unlock new little fleeces for the boys. Yes. Fleece of the lamb. Okay, so I can't afford any of them right now. Oh, what did I just do? A bonfire ritual. Dance around the flames to increase the cult's faith. Yes. Yes, please. I want to increase the faith of my boys. Yeah. What do I need? Bones? I need bones for that? Oh look, they're so happy. They can't wait for a little bonfire dance. And neither can I. Uh, yeah, so I need bones for that. I haven't seen any bones. Uh, so I preached my sermon for today. The boys are happy, having a great time. Preaching sermons, performing rituals, and providing for the needs of your followers will keep the faith high. Bones of your enemies required to perform such rituals. Okay, so I get them from the enemies. Okay. Destroy the skeleton. Destroy, destroy their skeletons to gather their bones. Return to the lands of the faith, gather bones from fallen enemies, recruit more followers, and return to perform a ritual here in the temple. I want to hang out with 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 Keith and um, and Colin. He keeps sending me back out. Perform rituals in temple. Okay. Okay. After slaying a non-believer. Desecrate their bodies to gather their bones and use them to perform a dark ritual at your temple. A non-believer? Who could it be? Was it... Is it little poop? Is it stinky little poop? And the boys are building their beds for the night. <laughs> Thanks, Keith. Can I sleep in it? Reassign. Oh, I can assign them to their little beds too. Okay, stinky little poo. You build your bed. Uh, let's receive some some of that. Thank you. Uh, oh yeah. Uh, 
Julna. <sighs> okay, let's name another one. Um, what are we thinking? I feel like we need to we need to make a girl. There's too many boys. Uh, girl's name. Girl's name. Tina. <laughs> Tina. Just Tina. Tiny Tina. Uh, Tina. What's the name? Marge. How about Marge? Tina or Marge? What are you, what are you saying? Oh, maybe I'm leaning more towards Tina. Uh, thanks, Alice. Thanks for joining, man. <laughs> I appreciate you being here. Thank you. I'm gonna go with Tina, and I quite like I quite like a little a little spotty form at the minute. I think I think that's just fine. Okay. Welcome, Tina. Welcome to the welcome to the club. That's a nice little vest. I like it. Uh, you can. What am I gonna get you to do? Um, I think I'm gonna get you to get some rubble. I think. Oh, is this? Oh, there's another one as well. Confirm it, your card. Um. Okay. We've got another name. I've got Tina. Hmm. Let's call you Bela. <laughs> and let's go for yeah, let's go for that. A little Bela. Oh, look at little Bela. So cute. And let's make her. Let's make her orange. No worries, Omar man. Thank you so much for joining. Really appreciate it, dude. Um, enjoy your meeting. Um, I'll catch you later, dude. Thanks so much for coming. Okay. Let's go. Welcome, Bela. I'm gonna get you to worship, please. Thank you. <gasps> they, one of them pooed! Unsanitary conditions at your cult will cause your followers to become sick. If your followers become sick, sign them to bed rest or they could die. Resting will allow them to slowly recover. Jesus Christ! Who didn't use the toilet? Poop, vomit, and dead bodies cause illness to spread throughout your cult. Jesus Christ! Can I not hire Gabe, uh, Gabe? Keith to do this? So embarrassing. Okay, another meter to upkeep. Okay. Good job, Keith. Keep it going, man. <laughs> there were refreshments in the worship hall. Yeah, can we can we feed them the poop? Have I got the poop? Oh, is that? I can fast forward time. Woo! Oh, there are not enough beds for your followers. <gasps> no! Oh man, we need to sort that out. Uh... Oh jeez, who um, who can't sleep? I feel bad. There's two of them, I think, isn't it? Two of them. Oh, Bella, you're sleeping on the floor. Why can't can't I send can I send you to bed? I'm <laughs> Look, there you go. Come to, there you go. There you go. Okay, now I feel a little bit better. Uh, let's build another one for. I'm struggling to remember their names. Tina, come on, Tina. Your bed's just over here, Tina. Come on in. Oh, they both like fighting for the bed. <laughs> Are they both in the same bed? Tina! Bella! What? What's going on? 
That's it. How is that even? I just... You know what? I'm saying nothing. They're lovers. Okay. Can I sleep? Um, I better make some food for them as well. They're getting a little bit low. Um, there we go. I'll leave that out for you boys in the morning. A little bit of breakfast. A little continental breakfast on the side for you there when you're when you're ready. I just tuck you in. I just tuck you in. There you go. There you go. All right, nice and cozy there, Bella. Nice and cozy, Tina. Um. So I go back. Okay, I think I've got to go back to. That was it. Oh, okay. Morning, everybody. How did you sleep? I didn't sleep at all because I'm hard working unlike you lazy shits. Alright, let's go get some bones. How many do we need for this first organ? Seven. Okay, we're nearly there. Back to the Darkwood boys. <laughs> Let the bodies hit the floor. Let the bodies hit the... Hmm, okay. Convert... Convoke a violent eruption of powerful tentacles or a fast blade. Um, let's go with the tentacles. Or can I use both? Oh, I can use both. Hey, cha! Wow. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, Jesus. What is this? Oh, God. Okay. Things are stepping up a little bit now. Okay. Okay. Easy. Oh, I got a little heart. Thank God for that. <laughs> I took a bit too many hits there. Hey, Rob. How's it going, man? Thank you about the Steam Day video stuff, man. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Um, it was a lot of fun putting that video together. I really enjoyed it. I've, 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 I've got tons more planned. Oh, I'm struggling to find the time to uh, sit down and film them and edit them and stuff. But um, I've got some more sort of Steam Deck videos coming in the next couple of weeks, I I hope. But I have got another non-Steam Deck video coming out, hopefully this weekend. Um, yeah, I've just got to finish some edits on it tomorrow. But um, yeah, that should be cool. Quiet plant put. Oh yeah, I feel like I got a some seeds and stuff, didn't I? I completely forgot about that. I need to start using them. Organize your farm with this handy signpost. I will. I will organize my farm with that handy signpost. Thank you very much. Uh, let's get some... Oh! Hi! Hi, Fornius. Beauty is truth. Truth, beauty, and that is all you need to know. And that is all you need to know of your heart. What is? What the hell is she talking about? Uh, let's go for blueprint. Oh, cool. We we'll get a little statue of a. We we'll get a little statue of Keith. Nice. Uh, I should really plan where I'm going a little bit better. I've just been going completely randomly at the minute. Okay. Yep. Oh, I've completely forgotten about this. 
Whoa! That's some um, anime hentai shit. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Mate, that's sick. Give me some of that flare blur. And another one for you. I hope you like anime. Oh, he do He touched it. What a bad boy. Oh, I'm out. Mate, I'm gonna have so many followers. Yes. Oh, nice haircut, dude. It's like a. You've got like a little short back and sides going on there. Yeah, handsome horsey boy. <clears throat> oh yeah. Give me some of that devotion, baby. Oh my god. Oh Jesus. Wait, what did, what did these even do? Ooh. Oh, is that it? You suck. Flaming shot too. Don't we already have that? Oh, no. No, I'm keeping my tentacles. Definitely. Definitely. I'm recycling that. Tentacles for the win. Every time. Easy. Oh wait, was... Oh, I've already got a full... A full tentacle gauge. And what a better time to use my tentacles. Habata! Okay, okay. Oh, I haven't been cutting up the bones! No! God damn it! Or have I? Have I been... I've been completely forgetting about that, haven't I? God damn it! And a new necklace. I've, I haven't been... I need to start writing down things to do when I get back, because I keep forgetting to give my followers their, their stuff. Okay. You again? Uh, yeah, let's go for that, because at the minute, using those powers... Uh, drains a ton of that energy. Thank you very much, good sir. Ah. Oh. oh, it's all of them. So it's true, the Red Crown sits upon the brow of another. But how? We did everything we could to. It matters not. We need not bother Shemur with this. Deal with it, brother. As you command, my sister. I don't think I'm so scared, little lamb. I don't think I'm so scared. Oh. Okay, make sure to actually get the skeletons this time. I'm focusing more on the skeletons than I am the boy. Oh, Jesus. Oh shit, I'm out of here again. Yeesh. Mate, there's getting so many of them now. Okay. Hey, Red Devil Man, how's it going? Um, yeah, it's pretty cool so far. It's, it's, yeah, it feels very, like, uh, very unique in that it is, like, a proper cross between sort of, like, something like Hades and 
uh, like Animal Crossing or some kind of like world builder, Star, Star, uh, yeah, Star Valley or something like that. It's pretty cool. I've heard a lot about that the uh, Sniper Elite games. They're meant to be really fun. Two pound ninety nine. That is a bargain, man. No worries, dude. Um, thank you so much for joining, man. I really, really appreciate it. Um, have a great rest of your day, man. I'll catch you soon. A large torch. Okay, just what I need for for the stinky little poop head. Oh man, I really need to be paying more attention, I'm nearly dead. What was that? What was that, what's that blue heart? Um, see, I could really do with some health now. But I don't know how I get that. Overall weapon damage increase. Let's go for that. I don't understand what these tarot cards are. I just collect them. Is that I collect them and then I just get a chance to use them? Are they like, those things not go away in the middle? No, they don't. Great. Oh, shit. Thank you, thank you. Whoop. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. No, okay, this isn't good. This isn't good. Oh, flaming shot three. Yeah, okay, fine. I was enjoying the tentacles, but I think I need a bit of extra, of extra power. Oh man, I'm not ready for this. I'm not ready for this. I'm gonna die. 100%. 100%. Oh. Oh, Jesus. Mate, if I actually get through this, I'm gonna lose a mind. Mm. That gun's trying so hard. I really don't wanna have to do that ever again. Being so, I'm being so non-aggressive because uh, I don't want to die. Yep, 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 yep. Give me some of the good. Give me some of the good. Oh shit! Come on. Come on. Come on, babe. Yeah. 
<laughs> Nothing more powerful than some tentacles, am I right? Oh my god. I wish I had my axe. I prefer the axe. Axe and tentacles winning. Oh shit! See, I need to concentrate. It's enough talk about tentacles. So I'm getting excited. If I die, I'm going to be so pissed off. Ugh. Mate. Yes! Jesus Christ, I'm sweating like a little... Like, like Keith, and like a little piggy. Oh, look at my face! Jesus Christ. Don't worry, boy. I got you now. That was a bit intense, wasn't it? I mean, it probably looks very boring, but <laughs> I was just rolling the whole time. Uh, let's get some gold nuggets. Let's get some sweet gold nuggets. I'm glad you agreed, Kevin. It was tense. I was sitting on my foot that whole time and it's got completely dead. I was so distracted. Oh, okay. Let's go. Let's go home and heal. Heal my boy. Give give a necklace out to to Bella. I think I'm gonna give a necklace to Bella. Gonna do a little sermon in the church. Um, clear up the poop because you know what little stinky poop heads like. Uh, do not make the mistake of becoming the servant of your followers. They are for you to use for your advantage. The favorite race, spin it as you would for, as you spin it as you would gold. If you can always rein their trust with a well placed gesture of kindness, let it empower you. Let it give you license to do unspeakable things. Bend them to your will. I've got any the power to read their feeble little minds. Stop being so mean. Bella might be able to hear you. Uh, interact with the followers to read their thoughts as well as see how hungry, tired, or sick they are. Okay. I wonder what they're. I wonder what. I wonder what Keith's thinking. Well, that's another another thing on the list, isn't it? Let's go see what Keith's thinking. Probably thinking, I'm fucking sick of being in, in this cult with Mike. Oh, hey, Keith. Welcome what it Famished, I fear I've become naughty. But skin and bones, I beg of you. Is there anything to eat? So can we find out if he's actually hungry? Or he's just being a little, a little shit? Oh, no, he is hungry. All right. Sorry, Keith. I didn't mean to, to doubt you. I had a great conversation with the... So you can properly read their mind. Our glorious cult continues to grow. I've never been so sure of anything in my life. Okay. So how do... Oh yeah, they're hungry, man. <gasps> Bella and... Bella and Tina are... Oh, I just pissed off Tina by interrupting. I thought they were having an argument. I was trying to step in. I'm sorry, Tina. Um, let's, let's make them some food. They're not doing too good. I'm, I really need to like plant a farm, don't I? How do I do that? Can I do that? Oop. And I need to collect some inspiration. A body pit? Right, that's what I need. 
How do I do that? We need to feed the boys. Is that it? Oh, okay, now I can. Yes. Oh, did I just spend all my money? It'll be fine, it'll be fine. Oh, all the boys are coming to help. Mate, they were doing some great job of praying. Thanks, Bella. Thanks. Okay. Please spare me. Okay, we've got to name another one. Um, he looks like a bit of a fuckboy with that haircut. Uh, let's go, what's like a fuckboy name? Um, like, oh, I'm scared to say any names in case there's anyone watching with that name. What's a fuckboy name? I mean, Chad's the obvious one. Is that too obvious? Yep, yeah, Chad. Roger's my middle name. That's not a, that's not a Chad name. <laughs> Roger. That's like, my, that's my granddad's name. How dare you? <laughs> I'm thinking Chad. I'm thinking Chad. Or, ah, oh, there's got to be a more inventive name than Chad. How about like, hmm. I need some suggestions. What can we? What can we say? What can we say? Chad, uh, Bro Brock. That's a good one. Felix. Yeah. I like the name Felix. I think that's quite a sweet name. Let's go. Let's go, Brock. Yeah, another one for Brock. Are we going Brock? I like that. It suits. It suits the fuckboy haircut. We're going Brock, and we're gonna keep him as he is. That's a Brock looking, a Brock looking boy. Richard Dreyfus. <laughs> okay, Brock, welcome to the club. Let's see, um, what can you? Do help it. Oh, we got another one. I keep forgetting we're getting so many boys. Okay, I'm kind of getting like emo girl vibes from this one. What's like an emo girl name? Um, Alice. <laughs> um, what's the name? What's the name of uh, the girl in Twilight? Be no, is that Bella? I already named one Bella, haven't I? Is that it, Bella? Um, what's an emo girl name? Um, let's go for Alice. Sorry, Alice. <laughs> Materialistic. Typical emo girl. Typical Alice. Welcome to the club. And let's get you to... Tubs and trees. New recruit is naturally skeptical. Gah. Alice, what the hell, man? Let's read Alice's mind. What are you, what are you thinking about, man? Materialistic. Yeah, I'm converted, but not convinced. Let's see how things go. Pathetic. I mean, to be fair, I haven't built her a bed, so she's right in that. Oh, I've got so much to do. I've got to plant some seeds. Give them water. Oh, God. Um, and I haven't built them enough beds. My God, you guys are so needy. Oops. Why oh, can't... There we go. Plant some food for the boys. Uh, I'll make them some breakfast again. I 
feel like there's a lot of hungry boys here. I don't know if I can feed them individually though, because uh, Keith was really hungry earlier and maybe he can't get enough enough food. Uh, where? Oh, poor. Oh, Alice, to be fair, you're a little bitch. I hate you. Um, you can sleep outside. <laughs> where is everyone else? Oh, okay. Uh, Brock's over here. I feel bad for him. Oh, have I woken him up? Read mind. Yeah, see what he's thinking. Yeah, sorry. He's homeless. Uh, our coat grows in greatness. I've never been sure of anything in my life. Okay, Brock's a good... Good boy. Brock's a good boy. Uh, whereabouts is the music school? So, uh, we, like, we run it in Essex. Um, but we, like, work all over the place, really. Like, we um, go into different, like, schools and different care centres. Like, we're sort of quite like a mobile service. Um, so we'll, like, get funding and we'll go to, like, yeah, like, a residential home or, like, a care home or something. Um, but we have like a disability club night that we run once a week um, So that's like I suppose like our base for doing the music stuff But it's a lot of fun man. It's a lot of fun. My god. They sleep so quick. I haven't even made had time to make you breakfast <laughs> And I need some more berries Jesus Christ so needy Hey, stinky little poo. How are you? The crow is growing day by day. It's time to give it a name. <gasps> oh my god. We get to name the cult? What is the name of your cult? Oh man, this is a big decision. Um, uh, cult of the Keith. <laughs> Cult of the Keith? Cult of the... <gasps> Steam Deck Boys. <laughs> Mike's mates. <laughs> I, think, I, I think it's gotta be Steam Deck Boys. I think it's gotta be. What else? What else could it even be? I'll hear some. I'll hear if you've got any suggestions, though. If there's a better suggestion, I'll think about it. But I think it's got to be Steam Deck Boys. We going Steam Deck Boys? Let's go Steam Deck Boys. <laughs> it does have a nice ring to it, stinky little poo. It does. Uh, you now have enough followers for your beds. Nice. Nice. Um, but they are hungry. Yeah, so let's make them some food. And I could probably do with making them some more, to be honest. But, oh, for goodness sake. Alice, was this you? <gasps> Fertilizer? Okay. Can I fertilize the crop? <gasps> Amazing. <laughs> well, Alice, you were good for something. You idiot. You idiot. Yeah, Rob. How's it going, man? Thank you, dude. I really appreciate it. Thanks, man. I'm glad you're enjoying the videos. Let me know um, what you think of those games as well. Like, I seriously have so much time for uh, Nier. Yeah, I think about it most days. Um, I, I, I always want to talk to someone about it, but um, I don't think like, none of my friends have played it. Um, but I'm so desperate to talk to someone about it. It was a life-changing experience playing that game. Okay, collect reward from Keith. Keith's got me something. Oh, Keith. Thanks, boy. 
Oh, for goodness sake, Alice, you're fucking disgusting. <gasps> we're nearly, we're nearly a berry level. Hello. How are you? Great leader, when times are tough, we can cook grass meals. Followers don't like it, but it beats starving. Try it now. Okay. Um, interesting. So if I decline, she loses faith. Cooking grass meals. Minus faith. Ah. How do I collect grass? I can't cut it. Okay, I'll gather it from somewhere else. I, yeah, so the um, near replicant, uh, I have played it as well. Again, really, really good game. Um, the music in it in particular is really, really good, like super beautiful. And it's quite, it's quite similar in to Automata. Um, I'd say they're very similar. I wouldn't say you at all need to play one to one, like, want to know what's going on in the other one they're very separate but they do interconnect like there's some like secret endings that sort of connect them up together which is really cool um but yeah you don't need to play replicant to know automata i, I personally would say play automata first i feel like that's the stronger the stronger game and if you enjoy it play replicant um but i do think replicants just it's just an old game so it doesn't quite like have the same beats and the same like uh, production value that Automata does, and Automata, to be fair as well, like their combat is a good bit better um, and just feels yeah a bit more like stronger and a bit more modern if you get me. But both really good games. Uh, give me the goods, Keith. You truly are divine. Yes, Keith. Good boy. Good boy. Make Alice eat grassy gruel. Ah, <laughs> oh, they're having a little, having a little chat. Ah, oh, everyone's having a great time here. I really need to make some more food. Jesus. Can I get them to? Oh man, a lot of them are hungry. How do I f make the grass meal, man? I can't doubt, cut down in the grass. Okay, there we go. I think there were some more berries over here. Oop. Cleaning up some poop. Getting some rocks. What happens when we completely clear out this area? some more stuff. Farming bundle or a body pit. I mean, I'm intending to not kill anyone yet. So let's go for the farming bundle. A farm station allows followers to water and need back ups. Um, sure, sure. King's little little king story. I've never I've never heard of that. Is it um that sounds like uh almost like um uh like the Harvest Moon games, is it like that? Cult 2. Oh cool. Okay, so we can like level up the whole cult. Okay, cool. Mate, there's so much stuff to upgrade to. Look at this! Jesus Christ! This game is involved, man. Okay, everyone's got a bed. You're all totally fine. Stop complaining. Okay, so we need... Okay, so we need some... We need some more money. 
We're doing pretty good on the wood and the materials. That's not too bad. But we need to get some more money. So we really need to go back into... We need to go back into the dungeony sort of area, don't we? Okay, let's get these walled up. No worries, man. Yeah, let, let me know how you find it. Oops. Um... Yeah, honestly, man, Neo Automata is just like one of the best games ever. Absolutely love it. Um, what else do I need to be doing? So I need to get some grass. I need to do a sermon. I need to have a little chat to my follower boys. Oh, God. I need to collect some of that. I'm guessing I can't hold a sermon at night. If I, if I do this, are they going to be annoyed? Let's try. Okay, so we haven't got anything to upgrade any of this. Uh... Oh yeah, we need to do the bonfire ritual, don't we? Although, do I need to do that right now? Oops. Oh, I've just woken them all up. <laughs> Sorry, boys. Sorry. Three new curses will appear on your crusades. Bane weapons. Bane weapons have a chance of poisoning any of the Mmm, sure. Let's go for that. Ooh. Thanks, boys. No, I can't do it. Uh, well, no. While you're here, can I do a little, a little bone ritual? Let us dance deep into the night. Let's do it. Yeah. I mean, not much of a party, but I'll take it. <laughs> okay, so everyone's loving me, but everyone is very hungry. There's so much more you can take from them. Give them gifts, complete quests. Oh yeah, we need to give Bella her necklace, don't we? Once they're loyal to you, they'll give you everything they earn. What does that show you, follower? Come back in here. Oh, Keith. Ah. Ah, oh, Keith's happy about that. Thanks, Keith. Increase your followers' loyalty to level them up. And they will reward you with devotion and a commandment stone fragment. Each time a follower levels up, they will generate additional devotion. And a sermon worship in the shrine to be sure to cultivate their loyalty. So... Okay, to increase the loyalty, you, you can give a follower a blessing once a day when you interact with them. You can also give them gifts, complete quests for them, perform sermons and many other actions. Okay. I have much to teach you, but I am old and grow weary. Visit me at my home and I will show you how to harness the true power of the Red Crown. Oh my god, we can, there's so much in this game, Jesus Christ! We can travel over there? Oh. I woke, yeah, look, they hate me, did you see that on the side? Like, everyone hates me for waking them up. <laughs> Whoops. A bed, oh my god, a bed has collapsed? Jesus Christ! <laughs> These are looking. These are looking nearly ready. Mm. Yeah, I still need a load more gold for that. Yeah, let's try and level up Keith because I want to find out what that does when they're leveled up. How do I...
interact and can I I can give blessings. So I can only do that to one person a day. Yeah, let's give him a little blessing. Okay, he really likes that. No worries, Keith. I'm glad you enjoyed my blessing. And now, uh, no, Stinky Little Pooh is alright. We'll give him a blessing if I can. Oh, we can. Oh, okay, so we better go round to everyone and give him a blessing then, bet, might we? Uh, everyone but Alice. I, don't, I hate Alice. <laughs> Um, I I have started Stardew Valley. Yes, I have, man. Um, oops. Oh, uh, I have given Stardew Valley a go. I'm not going to give Alice a blessing. Um, I like it. Again, it's hard to find the time to play so many games. I was been really busy playing the the Steam Deck games that um, I made in the video so that's taken up a lot of my time but I ha I did start it about like four weeks ago and it is really good I can see how addictive uh, that kind of game is and it's another one that's like really good for Steam Deck I think because you can uh, just so quickly like pick up and play it it's um yeah like perfect for that sort of thing okay let's give you a little blessing um, I think I'm gonna give him a necklace as well. Although I'm Colin, that's it. All right, Colin. I'm gonna give you a little pet. Yeah, yeah. Ah. And I'm gonna read your mind, actually. Inspiring ceremony, glorious cult. Yep. Yep. He's looking good. It's unenthusiastic new recruit. Well, that's mean. I had such a great time dancing with my fellow cult members. <laughs> oh, Colin. You make me laugh. Let's give you... Loyalty. Oh, so, so this one... Yeah, let's make, let's make Colin live unnaturally long. I'm sure he'll appreciate that. Let's give Bella some love. I bless you, Bella. A good girl, Bella. A good girl, Bella. Um, already done, Keith. Is there anyone else we haven't given a little pat for the day? Uh, I think I've done all you. So can we do anything to level up Keith? Is there anything else I can anything else I can do? Why can't I pet him? Can I give you another gift? No, I don't want to spoil Keith. Oh. Why is the music stopped? Why is the music stopped? Is something gonna happen? Oh no. <laughs> okay, is there anything? Oh man, they're really hungry. Bella's starving. Oh Jesus. Oh, there's no berries anywhere, is there? How am I meant to feed them? I can't. <laughs> Oh, Bella. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Bella. Um, the only thing I can do... ...is leave. <laughs> I'm sorry, Bella. Um, but before that, let's go check out the shack. animal form your followers can take. Hmm. Okay. Let's go see our little rat boy. 
Hey. <laughs> you have discovered my humble cottage. Be careful. You don't make the same mistakes I did or you'll end up in a place just like this. Now perhaps a game of knuckle bones? You don't know it? Why, it's simple. Step up to the table and I'll show you. Okay. What is this? I get to raise the loyalty of a follow-up. Okay. Nice. Let's give that to Keith. Oh wow, a dice game? Mate, there is so much to this game. I didn't realize it was this like, this in depth. Okay, when, I need to concentrate on this because otherwise I will not understand it. When dice of the same number are placed in the same column, multiply their value. Destroy your opponent's dice by matching yours to theirs. Okay, when dice of the same number are placed in the same column, multiply their value. All right, maths isn't my strong suit, but let's give it a go. Okay. Oh, okay. Wait, so if it's a number above, no, I need to match it. Six. Mm. No, that was stupid, I think. I don't know if I'm understanding this. So I've got to I've got to match the numbers to his. I think that's right. No worries, Eva man. Thanks so much for joining. Really appreciate it, dude. Hope you have a great rest of your evening. I'll catch you soon. Thanks, man. Uh, ooh, now, anywhere I place it, I don't think it's going to be right. I'm so confused. I won! <laughs> Easy. I knew exactly what I was doing. <laughs> EZ. Math genius. That's me. Oh, thanks. An extra heart. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you, little rat boy. Now you had to taste the game, okay to wager some coin. Uh, maybe later, ma'am. Maybe later. That hurt my brain a little bit. Ah. Oh. You've got such a... Such a lush garden, rat boy. Look at all this stuff. Oh, is playing oh, so um, our friends on their way to join me for a game or two as we speak. A rowdy bunch, to be sure. But now I'm retired, I'm free to enjoy myself. Yes, please. Thank you. Thank you. All right, so is that. So we play the game. <gasps> Berries, yes. I needed some of that. Big time. <laughs> Everyone's dying back at home. <laughs> okay. So we got some berries. We got some... We got... 
some gifts for the boys. Let's go and make sure they're not dead. Steam Deck boys. <laughs> okay, who is... Yeah, the boys are seriously hungry. Let's make two of these. Alright, come on, Bella. Yeah, you're like dying, man. Uh, Colin, do you need it? Do you need it, Colin? I feel like you're being greedy. <laughs> They're no longer starving. Oh, Colin! Jesus, dude. <gasps> yes, that is exactly what I needed. Literally perfect timing. Amazing. Oop. Wait, so I only I get one flush off each for each thing. Okay. I was hoping they were gonna just regrow. But no. Okay, so let's make some more food for the boys. Yeah, they seriously need some food. And then I'll replant. And then, we'll see where we are. Okay, come on then boys. Flock to my berry stew. How much gold do I need again for, oh man, that, that berry stew's making them shit all over the place. <laughs> Unbelievable. Although, good timing actually. You can add some fertilizer here. Um, has it been another day yet? Can I can I bless them? Yes. Oh wait, no, that was Alice. I didn't want to bless her. Oh, Jesus. God damn Alice. Okay, let's... Where's... Keith, can I give you a blessing before bed? No. Okay, let's wait until they go to sleep. Let's wait, sorry. Let's wait until they wake up. I'm going to bless Keith and see what he gives me. And can I build anything in the meantime? Need I need some more gold for that and that. I need a lot more gold for that. Um, let's grab some more berries. Yeah, man, I have got some more videos lined up. I've been editing uh, a one yesterday. I filmed it and edited it, most of it yesterday. I've just got to put some last little bits of editing on there. Uh, and I'll probably post that uh, ho hopefully tomorrow if I get time. I've got quite a lot of work to do tomorrow, but I'm going to try and quickly do it tomorrow. Um, but it's like a, I I'm a bit worried about posting it if I'm honest. Um, it's like a, it's like a speaker review, but I don't know how many people are going to be very interested in it. But, but it was still fun. It's like I think I'm going to like sort of start a bit of a series in like just reviewing like weird internet things and um yeah i've got this like weird like robot speaker thing that i, I just talk about i tried to make it like kind of light and not too serious um but then yeah i've also got um some steam deck videos that i really want to film i'm just waiting on one uh one little thing to arrive as i'm gonna mention it in the video uh, but i'm gonna be like testing out a load of steam deck stuff next week and yeah, then like talking about all these different little things I bought for my Steam Deck in a video. So that'd be cool, man. Um, 
Let me know if you guys have like any video suggestions. I've written this massive list, but um, it's always helpful to to have any suggestions as like thinking of video ideas can be like a little bit tricky. All right, so let's go and talk to Keith and let's see if we can level him up. Is that gonna be enough? Yes, nice. Okay, what was that? What was that? Was that something I can use in here? Thank you, ma'am. I, yeah, I have considered the Steam Deck Dog, man. That's a funny word to say, isn't it? Deck Dog. <laughs> um, the only thing is, it's like, the, the official one is like really expensive. Um, is it like 80 pounds? Like 100 pounds or something? Let me actually Google that right now. I've got a feeling it's pretty expensive and uh, I'm not sure like the features necessarily make it worth it. So I actually have got a different dock. Um, it's like a considerably cheaper one like off Amazon. I think it was like, I think it was like 45 quid. Um, but it does like, it does like everything you sort of need it to do. Like it's got three USB-C, uh, like it powers fine, um, HDMI cable and an ethernet stuff. So I don't really know what the, big difference between that and like the the main dock is uh, the, the official dock sorry um yeah the the official dock is 80 quid which is like pretty expensive for what it is i think um i mean yeah i mean it supports 4k 60 which i think i think the one i got supports 4k 30 but are you gonna get 4K60 at Steam Deck? <laughs> Probably not. Um, or 1440p at 120 hertz. Which again, like, are you gonna are you gonna get that out of a Steam Deck? My PC struggles to get that. So, um, but I mean, I don't, yeah. Have you guys got one? I um, I do think just the regular like the, the generic like plug-in hubs also work totally fine which are like 20 quid so unless I think they're useful if you're like always uh, connecting it to a TV or a um, or a monitor or something and to be fair I've seen loads of people recently that uh, have actually like replaced their PCs with a Steam Deck which I think is fine for some people if you use your PC for light stuff I can totally see how that works um, so I think if you're one of those people, like the official dock or like a dock in general is worth it. Um, you can use the switch stand if you just want to use it as a stand. The switch stand. What's that, my man? Okay, let's perform another little. Oh, I've woken them up again. Shit! Oh man, they're gonna hate me for that. Sorry, sorry boys. Increase the starting level of weapons when you begin a new crusade. That sounds good. Curse the horde. Let's go for this one, that sounds better. Thank you, thank you. Love me. Love me, boys. Thank you. Okay, so they liked that, but I'm pretty sure they're going to be pissed because I woke them up. Nintendo Switch adjustable charging stand. Oh, I see what you mean. The Switch stand. Ah, oh, okay. Now I get it. <laughs> I, um, I unfortunately don't have a Switch, is the only thing. Wait, so you can... Oh, if you just want to use it as a stand. Yeah, totally, man. Uh, wait, why has this got an explanation mark to it? Can I do something here? Oh, yeah, okay. Declare new doctrine. <laughs> yeah, to be fair, that is cult behaviour. 
like that is totally something a mass murderer would do. Wake up their followers in the middle of the night, talk about law and order and possessions. <laughs> Have them proffer both labor, love. It's on the death is not the end. Instruct them on Teach them the true meaning of obedience. I mean, if I'm going to wake them up in the middle of the night, it's got to be about obedience, isn't it? Let's be honest. Punish sin or celebrate virtue. Oh, God. Murder follower. Unlock, unlocks the murder following action. A simple solution to many problems, but some followers may find this upsetting if they awake to witness it. Ascend follow a ritual. Perform a ritual to at your temple in which you can ascend a follower spirit to a higher plane of existence. All followers gain loyalty. Oh man. Um Oh I don't I I wanna be the person that like is like yeah let's let's murder some followers but I'm I'm a little I'm a soft little boy. Okay, I don't like, I don't like murder. <laughs> I smell Atlas getting murdered. Yes, she, she's at the top of the list. I'm tempted to take the murder for Alice. She's, I hate her. Um, but, I mean, do I, do I get both? I think I'll get both at some point. For now, I'm going to ascend Keith and then later murder Gabe. I mean, murder Alice. Oh, look, everyone loved it. Everyone loved it. Oh my god, there's so much to this game. I don't think I can do any of this. Oh, I can. Okay, let's... Why can't I do that? Oh wait, do I find it in here? Yes. Oh, I need more bones. Okay, nearly got enough. Bonfire rituals on cooldown. Okay, so I think that's, I think that's all. Good job, boys. I really wanna make Alice Alice eat a gra some grassy gruel, but uh, how, do, how do I get grass? Oh, they're having a bad time. They're not. They're not enjoying each other. Um, the Steam Deck dock might be beneficial if one needs a HDMI port and an Ethernet port. That's very true. However, the dock that I got, which is half, well, nearly half price, has an Ethernet port and a HDMI. So I'm just wondering what the actual benefit of the official dock is over like the the knockoff ones. Hey Colin. Shalamba, this place is gross, if you don't pee someone get sick. What are you talking about? I'm keeping it clean. Where's where's the mess? Oh so oh okay. Someone's been having a field day over here. Oh Colin and Bella have become friends! Mate, I love this game. <laughs> this is great. Oh. Better water the plants. The the boys still really need some food. Um, I feel like we're doing good on everything but the food. I really need to go back and get some more gold, really, so I can get the farming station set up. Um, but let's let's read Brock's mind. How are you doing? Inspiring sermon. Gross. Someone should clean up that before someone gets ill. I have. Okay. Defecated outside. <laughs> Built an outhouse so I can poop in peace. <laughs> I I'm I will. Okay, Brock. I will. But if you're moaning, you're not getting a necklace. Okay. Uh, Stinky Little Poo, how you doing? Let's read your mind. Ew, sore poop. Ew! You've got poops on your head, mate. What are you talking about? 
Built an outhouse so I can poop in peace. Okay. I'm getting the vibes that the boys want a toilet. And it makes me sick. They should be, they should be grateful for everything I've done for them. Oh, okay, I can level up the cult already. Let's go. Woo! Yeah! Yeah, boy! Cult upgraded. That's what I'm talking about. Nice. Um, okay. Let me just check if I... Decorations. Yeah, let's build a little... Let's build a little statue of, of Keith. I'm gonna... I'm gonna plop it down here. I feel like Keith deserves pride of place. <gasps> we can build another one. Mm, that's, mm, that's not symmetrical. Mm, yeah, that'll do. Alright, Keith. Build yourself a little statue. Hey Tyler man, how's it going dude? Thanks for joining. It's all good man, it's all good. Better late than never. <laughs> I'm just, honestly, I am just so d d un unbelievably grateful for anyone joining. This is mad that there's like 17 people been watching for the last two hours. Like, uh, yeah, I feel incredibly grateful. Thanks so much for sticking around, guys. I really appreciate it. Um, it's been really fun. I hope you've had a good time. I'm going to shoot off in a second, I think. I think I'm going to tidy up some little jobbies. And then I'm going to shoot. Sorry, Tyler, man. <laughs> I know you just joined. But um, I think if you guys have enjoyed it today, let me know. Um, and maybe I'll do another one. Maybe I'll carry on the Steam Deck Boys party. And carry on loving Gabe. I mean, Keith. And having a good time. Um, still can't build the grass stuff. Thanks, man. It's it's a weird one. Like, um, when like being the one who's actually like doing the streaming, I'll, I'll often watch other people stream, but it's really weird when you're like, on the other side. It's like, is is this at all good uh, or enjoyable for anyone? It's really hard to know. Um, but oh, thanks, man. Thanks, Brian, man. I really I really appreciate that. I say it's hard to know if you're doing a good job. Um, but I just, yeah, I appreciate you guys being here and sticking around. That's, um, yeah, made my day, man. Thank you. I think as long as just like one person wants to join and hang out, that's like, that's more than enough. Uh, so the, yeah, the fact that there's like a couple of you here is honestly, that, yeah, I know I keep, I keep saying like, thank you and oh my God, but like, it honestly is like super, super nice that you guys stuck around. Um, feel very, very, very grateful. Thank you. But enough thanking. Let's hold another sermon <laughs> and talk about death. <laughs> Rob, thank you, man. That's really kind. Thank you, dudes. I really appreciate it. Thank you, man. Oh, can I send him back to work? Back to work, Colin. You little shit. <laughs> okay. These berries are taking their sweet time, man. Thanks, Alice. I appreciate that. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks for sticking around. I appreciate it. I thought, I don't know, I thought it'd be boring for people, but
but yeah, I appreciate it. Thank you. Um, right, I think we're pretty. I think we're pretty. Oh, we can cl collect a reward from Colin. Oh, I feel bad for interrupting him now. Woo! Nice. Yeah, you're totally right, Dominic. I, I think there was there definitely be an advantage um, in some way to the official Steam Deck dock, but um, yeah, I, I need to sit down and watch some some like comparisons. Um, but I might I might I might get it and make I could even make a video about like comparing Steam Deck docks. <laughs> um, so maybe that'd be a video idea. But eighty pounds is just a lot amount a lot of money, man. Okay, so I think we're pretty, pretty well tied up. The boys are really hungry, but hopefully once we set up a little farming system with some more gold, that will be better. Uh, actually, I could probably plant some more seeds, couldn't I? That would be a good idea. Oh, do I don't have any grass. How do I, how do I get grass? I would have thought the grass would have been the easiest thing to get. Why can't I just cut it here? Am I being an idiot? Can I get someone to cut the grass? Clear rubble, chop trees. Mm. Collect some stone, we need to break this big boy down. Uh. No worries, dude. Um, no, yeah, no worries, Brian. It is, um, it's such a sick game to play on the Steam Deck, Final Fantasy XIV, because I, like, I, I am personally not one of those people that spends like too much time in like dungeons and raids and that. I really enjoy doing like story quests and the more like casual stuff. I know that's really lame, but um, yeah, the Steam Deck for that is just like perfect, especially when there's like lots of dialogue, and uh, I quite like the crafting stuff as well. I find the uh, the is that the lumberjack or like the wood cutting quest line? I find that really fun. So yeah, Steam Deck stuff for that is like sick. Yeah, what? Let me know what you um what you play on fourteen. I am an archer boy. <gasps> I better feed my followers. Um, yeah, I'm a bard. Um, I've been thinking about trying a tank for some time. But being a tank just makes me scared. <laughs> like, I feel like there's so much responsibility that comes along with the tank. Hey, Keith. Uh, what device is it this game for? Uh, do you mean the game I'm playing? And yeah, I believe Call of the Lambs on Xbox, if you want to play it on there. Um, yeah, exactly. That's what I mean. It's it's just a lot of money for just what a deck is. I, I say you can essentially get a like a USB C hub, which does the exact same thing for like twenty quid. Um, again, I don't think it supports the same kind of output. It won't support like four K at sixty frames. But I say I'm not sure that, that uh, like a Steam Deck will ever be able to output that kind of resolution. So I, I don't really. I don't really think it's usable. Um, glorious leader, the base is an eyesore. We need to celebrate your glory. Let us build decorations in your honor. Okay. I, I mean, I've already built two decorations. Have you not seen them? Oh, boy's hungry. Let's make let's make some food quick. Is it free? This game? No, it's not free. But it's only, to be fair, it's only like, I think I got it for like 12 or 15 quid or something. It's not too expensive. And I'm actually, to be fair, I'm really impressed with like how much there is to this game. It's been really fun. Yeah, there's a lot to it. It seems like quite, quite a deep, 
deep game. This actually, ironically, uh, strikes me as the kind of game that would be very good on Steam Deck. Along with like things like Stardew Valley and that. I think this I think this is actually available on Switch as well. I could be wrong. But yeah, it's super cool. Art style is super, super nice. Uh, very like, yeah, like Paper Mario, like we said earlier. Um, I love the colours and stuff. Uh, oh my god. What have I been doing? The guys are literally going to die. They need some... They need some serious love. Oh, look at how pissed off they are. <gasps> Mate, <laughs> I have not been doing a good job at all. I'll let them eat. No longer starving. Okay. Yeah. I seriously need to sort that out. Thank you. Thanks for that, mate. Yeah, same, man. I, I um, I used I used to play a bit of Warcraft, but to be honest, it never like proper clicked with me. Um, and I tried some other MMOs, like I tried like the Star Wars one. And I was always just like, well, it's fine, but um, I was never really like properly taken by them. But um, I tried the Final Fantasy trial at the beginning of the lockdown where I had like nothing to do. And like for two weeks straight, I just got so sucked in. I don't, I wouldn't, I wouldn't have tried it unless there was that free trial, but it really gets you, man. It totally sucks you in. Yeah, I, I do think if you're going into an uh, MMO new, I think uh, tank is like a tricky role to take first because I think you've got to be quite confident in a lot of the um, like the dungeons and that you really have to lead them. So I think I think the DPS is quite nice to play as it's quite easy, but the queues are much longer. Uh, but I I enjoy the bard stuff. That's been fun. Parappa the Rapper, yes Josh, you know, that is ex I was trying to think earlier of what this game reminded me of, and that is so accurate, that is exactly the style of this, it's like Parappa the Rapper, uh, Paper Mario, uh, Animal Crossing kind of mash. Thanks Michael, appreciate that man, I've got some more Steam Deck videos coming in the next couple weeks, um, also got another video coming in the next couple days, um, so yeah. I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna make uh, a video on like Steam Deck accessories next. I've got some cool ones that came uh, in the mail this week. So I've been looking at them and playing with them and I'll talk about them in a video, I think. Okay, so I've already preached a sermon. Everyone hates me still. Maybe I can just very quickly Give him some love. Oh. oh. Thanks, Alice. Yeah, I really need to be interacting with them more, really, don't I? Yeah, totally, man. I, I feel exactly the same. Like, oh shit, I just interrupted Keith. Oh my god, they're going to bed already? God, you guys work so fast. Um, um, yeah, I'm also not good with stressing games at all. Like, I that's the only thing I, I, I don't like so much about Final Fantasy. And it's not that it's like Final Fantasy's fault. It's more just like the MMO genre in general. But like the stress of going into a dungeon or a raid when everyone's like charging off. Um, and in Final Fantasy in particular, it might be the same in some other MMOs, but there's so, there's so much to do um, and manage. And there's a lot of like in the sort of slightly later dungeons, there's so many, um, uh, oh, what's the word? Like 
bosses will do certain things and you have to like I don't know, do like these crazy actions to like not die or there's like a proper process to all of them. And if you're the tank being like the main man, that can be like really scary. Um, yeah, it does make me anxious. Hence why I like lean more towards the casual stuff. Um, no worries, Josh, man. How you doing? Thanks for joining the stream, Josh. I really appreciate it, man. Um, uh, I, I was asked about the dbrand case. I absolutely was. Um, someone very kindly from dbrand messaged me um, a couple of weeks ago offering to send it to me for free and I was like yeah <laughs> absolutely but um, there was that big fault with it the kickstand on the back uh, damages the battery um, so they had to obviously like I don't know if you heard but they had to like recall um, Welcome, just about all of the pre-orders uh, some like youtubers got their hands on them still but um, I, I essentially asked, I didn't actually get it, but before he sent it out, I said to not bother sending it because I didn't want to make a video about it if it's like not available and the actual product that you're going to get at the end is going to be different to it. I just thought like, I, I would, the whole video would, need, would be me just saying like, no, don't get it. It's, you can't get it. It's broken. So I didn't, I didn't think it'd be worth them sending it to me, but when it when it's re-released i think they're re-releasing it in january uh so when that happens i will be getting one and i'll make a little video about it um but it looks it looks okay i do think uh i don't want to like bash off dbrand because i say they very kindly have offered to give me one but um i think the question is kind of like do you need a case when it comes with a really good hard case anyway do you know what i mean uh, and I'm not actually sure that the D brand case would fit in the case that you that you get. So, uh, yeah, I just feel like you'd be making the case defunct. But I think it definitely has some use. I think I think if you travel with it lots, or you're constantly putting it in and out of a bag, or you're just generally quite clumsy, like if you're prone to like dropping stuff. Which, to be fair, I am. Um, but yeah, it still looks really cool. They've done a good job on designing them. Yeah, Final Fantasy is very time consuming, man. In a good way, in lots of in lots of instances, like it's a it's a place that you want to be. It doesn't feel like you're just sucked in for the sake of being addicted. It feels like I don't know, when you play Final Fantasy, it's just like you feel like you're in like a warm, cozy place. And also the community on Final Fantasy is like unbelievably nice. Like I think that's one of its most positive factors is how lovely people are when i was saying earlier about like mmos being stressful that really helps like i'd go into a dungeon and like uh i would say oh i had this like message that i hotkey and essentially say like hey i'm sorry i'm new to this game and i'm new to this dungeon uh i hope that's cool with everyone and people will be like that's totally cool man um this boss has this kind of uh attack pattern and make sure to do this and they'll spend like two minutes like typing out what we should be doing for the boss and like <laughs> what other what other community or what other like sort of uh, person would take the time to be that nice in a, in a video game online yeah it's unreal yeah that's that's totally true the, the the case is a little bit bulky yeah you're right I think, yeah, if you're taking it in backpack slots and stuff, it really helps to um, have a case that's a bit slimmer like that. Uh, oh, okay, some shelter. That would be good. Nice. Okay, so we can... Build a little, a little shelter now. Cool. Oh, we actually have enough of that. Okay. Yeah, totally. The community, man. The community on Final Fantasy is literally the best community ever. Highly rare. Um. I keep I, I keep going to be like okay I'm gonna finish now but then 
All the meters are stressing me out. I feel like I need to top them right up before I finish. Let's do a quick little sermon and then and then we'll wrap it up. Uh, can I upgrade them? Vampire weapons, okay. Ah, oh, good night, Dardle Mag. Thanks for joining, man. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Uh, I'm anxious about time to play with other real people. Eventually, how deep into the game did you go before playing? Is there positives for playing before completing? Yeah, I I am about level 60 and I'm like most of the way through heavens heavens word um, and like I, th I think the realm reborn story isn't isn't the best but the ending if you get to the ending like the last uh, half an hour of the story is wicked like it gets super intense super quick um, and it makes you really want to carry on into that heavens world expansion um, and yeah, I think I know what you mean about being anxious about dungeons. I do totally get that. I would recommend like um, before you go into a dungeon or a boss fight, uh, YouTube the dungeon because it will talk you through like how to how to best work your way through it and any of those little, like, little tactics you need to keep in mind. And then also like put together a little message saying, hey, I'm just new to this game, not too sure how this dungeon works. Um, sorry if I'm a bit slow, and then just hotkey that to something, and every time you go into a new dungeon, just hit that. And once people know you're new to the, the game or new to the dungeon, I say the community is so nice that they're just totally chill and totally cool with, yeah, you may maybe not being like super, super on, on the ball with, yeah, the mechanics and stuff. Um... Okay. Right. No worries, dude. No worries. Have fun playing Final Fantasy. Great game. Alright, guys. I think I'm going to wrap up there. Um, let me just check. I have saved. Yeah, okay. And how do I quit out? I have saved it, haven't I? <laughs> One of those people that used to check about a million times. Oh, Jesus. My, uh, my controller just went mental. Um, cool. <laughs> All right. Um, thanks so much for joining today, guys. I really appreciate it. Um, I hope that was fun for you. It was really fun for me. Uh, that was that was really cool. Um yeah, again, I know I said it a couple of times, but thanks so much for sticking around. Uh, it feels really surreal that there's like people watching this. Um, uh, I hope this hasn't been too much of a mess. Um, I think I'll get better at streaming the more the more I go. Uh, but uh, hopefully you enjoyed it anyway. I don't know whether to leave this video up. Do I leave this here for people to watch or do I... Do I take it down? I don't know. I'm so new to all this YouTube stuff. It's scary. Um, yeah, thanks so much, guys. Really appreciate it. Thank you. Um, looking forward to the speaker review. Thank you. Um, I'm really scared about posting it because it feels a little bit... Uh, I don't know if it feels ingenuine, but I, I say I've tried to make it like light. You're hot. Thanks. Uh, thank you. <laughs> I, pre I appreciate that. Thanks. Um... All right. The stream is perfectly fine. Thank you. Thank you, dude. Um, I say, I think I want to work on it and, and get better at it. Uh, but you need to start somewhere. You know what I mean? You need to give, you need to give it, you need to give it a go sometimes. Um, I think compared to the, the nice, the nice thing about editing videos is that you can cut out the bits that you're like, why did you say that? And why are you such a mess? You can just cut out those bits. Whereas it feel, feels a lot rawer on stream. But I think, I think that's nice. Uh, uh, after like relaxing into it a bit, um, 
it feels it feels good <laughs> what am i saying <laughs> um but yeah thanks again for sticking around guys i really appreciate it um uh yeah as i said there's a new video coming out pretty soon uh hopefully tomorrow uh be cool to catch you on there um yeah feel free to send me a message anytime uh let me know if you want some more streams let me know if you want some more steam deck videos <laughs> both those things are coming anyway um but yeah thanks again everyone i know i've said it a billion times but hang on a second what's the chat rate chat rate of the stream at most recently time for two i don't know what that means um all right <laughs> thanks everyone have a wonderful rest of your day or your evening or whatever time it is wherever you are um i'll catch you really soon have a good one see you later goodbye <laughs>